Just walking from the uh, farm shop in uh, Kilmington, past the church, to the start of the link route to uh, Colleton. So we're out today uh, walking the link route, the way marked link route to the East Devon Way. Old fashioned telephone box. It's now used as a book exchange and a nice seat there next to the stream to relax in. The underlying geology here is uh, Cretaceous on top of Triassic and where you get the joint between the two you quite often get springs. I'm going to go up Springhead Lane. Well, oh, sun's come out really nice. Well, we're just uh, arriving here at this little stream. It's rather pleasant. And we're going to walk up past the stream into the woods. Walking through the dead leaves rustling on the ground. And eventually going to emerge from the forest. One last right angled bend. And then finally emerging onto the road. And then shortly you arrive at this treed triangle with a nice seat there. I think we'll sit and have a coffee. So we're going to take the track down now, following the link, down past Shoot House. Great view of the uh, Axe Valley, but uh, very difficult to take a shot because the sun is just blindingly reflecting off of the sea. And this is Shoot House. So we're now going to zigzag down the hill into the fields. Oh, and they've made a nice improvement to this path now with a new fence and widened it and over the stile. So once you've gone through these uh, two metal kiss gates and into this field, there is actually a crossroads in the middle of the field of footpaths. So you walk to about where Carol is now, and then you can turn left to a footpath, turn right up to a gate for a footpath, or carry straight on roughly in the direction we're going. And that's the way that the East Devon Way link goes. So once you come over the stile from the field, you come onto this track. Uh, we continue down this track towards Seaton Junction. So eventually we come out onto the road and you can turn left for Lime Bay Cider and Whitford and join another link route there to Colleton or Musbury. You could walk over the road bridge there, over the railway to Colleton if you wish, or you can turn right and follow the East Devon Way link over the footbridge over the railway, which is rather nice. Walking this way past the uh, old station at Seaton Junction. You only have to do a couple of hundred meters on the road and then it's almost off-road all the way to Colleton from then on. Right, here we are at the footbridge over the railway. It's a really long footbridge. Now there's just this one solitary line and it doesn't stop here anymore. A real shame. When we get to this point, the footpath actually turns slightly to the right there and goes between the barn and the house. But many people walk straight across the field from here. It's not a footpath, but lots of people go that way and there is a stile at the other end. Well, we decided to uh, stick to the footpath and walk up between the house and the barn. 
and we're shortly going to turn right into the field over there where there's a seat. For a moment, we're just going to go and sit on that seat over there. We're now entering a field that can get very wet after heavy rain. All right, so far. Well, I'm quite surprised how doable that was. Despite all the rain we've had lately, it's worked out fine. And I only had ordinary shoes on. So, uh, that was a good result. There's always something nice about walking alongside water. Holland in the background. Here we are at the next stile. We're going to walk diagonally across the field to the footbridge in the distance there. And yet another footbridge, one of many. There must be a shoot going on today because I can still hear gunfire from time to time. A few cows in the field but uh, not taking much notice of me really. Oh, a little bit muddy here. But still very doable. Getting fairly close to uh, Colleton now. The Rebel Town, that's what they call it. And several of the uh, Colleton men stood trial at uh, the Bloody Assizes, ruled over by Judge Jeffrey, and for its tannery, which is the only genuine oak bark tannery left in the country. Well, we're in the last field now and we're going to go diagonally up to the road. Early lambs. Just coming up to these double pedestrian gates. This is the last stile now before we get onto the road for the last few hundred metres to Carlton and to join the East Devon Way. There's the tannery I was talking about. And this is where we join the East Devon Way. And this is the River Collie the way into Colleton and uh, it's got loads of facilities there, cafes, restaurants, shops, accommodation, car park, 